has to be one of the most ridiculous, while at the same time, incredible finds I've ever found. That's fine. I see you flash your lights back there. It's like, I don't know what I'm doing, but. All right, wow, we're looking at a trash can. I did want to show you on the other side, but you can't see it, is the sun, oh, there it is. You can see a little red orange circle right in the middle. Well, when I drove up down the road, it looked a lot nicer than just that little circle. But welcome back, everyone. It's another day here at Taco Stacks. We're dropping off some donations and it's trash picking once again. So let's find some cool things out here, kind of on the injury list this morning, but we're going to still make do and hopefully find some cool things and hopefully even be able to pull out of here because traffic's crazy, but drop off some donations and find some cool things. Let's do it. What the heck? Did want to see this picture frame. VHSs. Looking in there, I don't see really much. I have a nice frame. Person has a swan. A swan planter. It's kind of cool. Lamp's broken, it's glass. That's why I stopped. Huh. Did not stop for these swans. I thought the swan was a lamp, swan lamp, but it's not, that's just a lampshade. And the other thing is just broken. Let's go back over here. Take these cassettes. I saw cassettes and I looked down like yeah then I thought again. I thought I saw Alabama in it. Don't they have like uh, like one or two good songs? Maybe Dixieland Delight. Does that strike a bell? Walk down the road. What's that down there? Nothing. Oh, I hear a garbage truck or a school bus. Must be the week of radios. And the funny thing is, like, I feel like now you're probably going to be using radios more and more as we start getting closer and closer to doing things in the garage, outdoors. Yeah, it's definitely a garbage truck. The things you find in the trash, man. I don't know where that garbage truck Oh, there it is. Right there. Thought I heard it. I don't have a uh, a bubbly to pop. Usually pop a bubbly or seltzer or aha something. Not sponsored. Whenever we get stuck behind one of those, but I guess we'll just go to the left. And what would it matter? Do, do, do. 
do. I don't know what the heck this is. Almost like a sled. Mm. I have no idea. It's interesting to me. This has to be one of the most ridiculous, while at the same time, incredible finds I've ever found. We just have to walk to it. It is so ridiculous, I just, you guys can kind of see it. Oh, that's nice. This table's kind of nice. a giraffe. There's someone down the road just like staring at me the other way. You get a lot of weird stares when you trash pick. If you're an introvert, you just get over it. But how can you pass up on a cool giraffe like this? Uh, now I'm just thinking about like if you buy this, you can't like put that in a car. That's two-thirds of my van. I don't know. You probably just... It's, it's a cool piece. So that was a pretty cool find there. Uh, we are now into March, which I'm shocked that we finally made it to March, but I guess that's what happens. You eventually get to certain months of the year. I guess St. Patty's Day is coming up. I'm so off of my schedule, it's incredible. Uh, but really cool find there. Right now, I'm actually, as you guys see, I might like, I'm turning like this. So my back, with my back spasms yesterday, finally the spasms are gone, but now like the muscle is just like, it's tightened up. So like to look down like this, this hurts. And to like look left and right, like it hurts right here. Um, that's about as far as I can go for range of motion. So, it is what it is. Got ourselves a couch. I think, um, I probably tweaked it when I lift that, uh, that water heater. I think that's what did it. Or that, uh, pressure thing. Pressure thing. The, uh, I just call it air pressure tank because I can't think of the word off the top of my head. But I think that uh, that did me in. And fortunately for me, it's not my lower back because I know if you screw up your lower back, you're kind of really screwed. It's my upper back. And it's that muscle where if you ever grab something and reach around something, you can feel like right in the upper middle in between the shoulder blades. You feel a little bit of a tightness, a little bit of a pull. That's that. Whatever muscle that is hurts. Um... I even thought today would be the day where I broke the streak of consecutive videos. Somehow, miraculously, I managed to get out of bed and figure my life out and say, you know, we're not going to do that today because there's treasure to be had. I'm very happy I went out and trash picked. What the heck is that? Uh, that's nothing. That's just boxes. I'm really happy I even got that at Giraffe. For a second there, I just, <laughs> I almost missed it. I don't know how you could miss it, but I almost missed it. And I don't think I'm going to be keeping it. This guy's flashing his lights and everything. I don't know what's going on over there, bud. I'm just about to get jumped. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> no, that, that's fine. I see you flash your lights back there. It's like, I don't know what I'm doing, but... Go, go. Hey, right, have a good one. That was very interesting. See how heavy this thing is. Not bad. I knew this would be a problem if I ever picked up a well, that last situation. I don't know what the heck is going on. Anyway. Yeah. That didn't hurt too much, but like grabbing this from like as far as you possibly can, stretching out your arms. If you go like this and try to lift it up, you can feel a, you, you go around it. You can feel a pull 
in your upper back, whatever muscle that is. is completely toast right now, but it'll be all right. So yeah, back to the scheduled program. That guy was honking down the road, flashing his lights. I saw it from afar. I thought he was like someone who was really, really late for work. That's just garbage, which is very possible. And he pulled up beside me. I seen like three kids in his car. I was like, oh, this is going to be great. Um, and he thought I was the school bus, like the school bus van. I know I did a whole... Uh, <laughs> I did a whole situation in a previous vision in a previous video um, on those school bus vans and if you're allowed to pass them I had probably 50 or 60 comments saying you can't pass a school bus which I know you can't pass a school bus but let's talk about the school bus van uh, which really isn't a bus it's just a van in fact now I'm looking back on it why would they ever have those school vans painted white just paint them yellow or school bus yellow like a school bus. That would have completely solved the problem that I just had. It's a lot of garbage. Hey, look, one of those kids' chairs. But if you just painted these school vans, school bus yellow, you would never have had the situation that I just had, which could have been very bad. Should have just pulled in over here, but I didn't know if I needed to. Yeah, I probably could have just made that. Yeah, I definitely could have made that. I might need these. Even though I don't think you'd really use these. No, you can't use these if your back hurts. That no. I don't know what you'd wear. Back brace? Who knows? The uh, that weird looking sled thing that I found. <laughs> I just drove down that road just now um, <laughs> and the, uh, the garbage man right now at the end of that street is struggling with a, uh, a couch. I can't imagine if you hurt yourself as a, ga uh, as a garbage man, how can you lift up, uh, how can you lift up some of these things, you know? I feel like it's one of those jobs where you really can't, uh, can't work if you're really hurt. We have a, uh, dog bed all righty so I think I've went to this pile once before now we're back here again they actually have some really old couches really old couches They have clawfoot, clawfoot bottoms. This is gorgeous. It's kind of broken. It's broken on this bottom corner. But just put that against the wall, you know? Now, wicker, which I assume that's what this would be considered, is probably the most difficult thing for me to understand. Because sometimes wicker isn't worth anything, and sometimes wicker is worth a ton of money. Everything's a ton of money when you buy a brand new something. Stinks. Hopefully it's not me. But this looks nice. I, I don't think I've ever seen a basket like this. Wow, it smells awful. Hope it's not that piece I was grabbing because it smelled all the way back, but it's a nice little basket thing. not planned. It literally just slipped <laughs> that well. I feel like my back's getting better as the video goes on. I mean, it's been about an hour and a half since the first clip. But then again, I probably just, the Tylenol 
starting to affect me a little bit better. I don't know. I really like this basket though. Kind of neat. All right, another fun day here with Taco Stacks. It was a great one. Oh, thought that was a groundhog. No, it's a squirrel running up the tree. In fact, a lot of these trees, there's actually a branch right there. You might be able to see it right there. Um, been really getting smoked by the wind recently. And I have quite the abundance of branches to pick up when it gets warm out. Just like I have quite the abundance of inventory to try to get rid of once it gets warm out. That giraffe is so cool. I can't believe I found that. That thing is incredible. It's got to be like seven feet tall. Astronomical. It looks like it's constantly, it's like broken there, but it's not. It also, same same thing with like its ears. It looked like it was broken. Maybe it is broken and they just painted over it. I don't know. It's kind of neat. Uh, I did pick up a quite abundance of other things. It's really, really neat basket. Almost looks like a wash tub. Um, in fact... When that thing fills up with water, is a day that I'll take a couple months off. Didn't find a bunch of cassettes. Oh, we got some classic jams here. I see Chuck Berry. There's some good songs here. Nope. And followed by some Bill Cosby. Chuck Berry's. This one got the one, uh, Johnny Be Good. That's a good song. Uh, rock and Roll Music. Good song. And I think the L. Oh, brown eyed handsome man, I think I know that one. And that's about it. Surf music. Surf music. There's gotta be some. Um... How do you not have the Beach Boys on surf music? There's no Beach Boys. Unreal. Uh, these other people I really don't know. Someone else probably does know them. Uh, like I said, oh, I do know Leanne Rhymes. I did see Alabama. This one had the... No. I always find these like random... Um... My home's in Alabama by Alabama. Oh, we got a whole thing. Madonna. Mama and the Papas. They have a good song that... Come on. California Dreamin'. That's the one. Got everything. Madonna. Queen. We have some Queen in here. More Madonna. Paula Abdul. A whole bunch of other great music. Carpenters. Completely broke all these things. But yeah. Uh... Got music, got wicker basket, got some scrap metal, and found ourselves a giraffe. So we found it all. Everything and a giraffe. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed yet another awesome treasure hunt. Thank you for coming along for another another day, another episode, or 560 episodes of Trash Picking. Uh, if you guys haven't checked out my playlist, haven't seen all 560 episodes, then watch a couple of them because 560 episodes is a lot and you'll probably spend a lot of your life watching me talk about treasure. If you're really bored, watch all 560 plus episodes, but that's going to wrap it up. Subscribe down below for more treasure hunts. Hit the like button if you guys enjoyed it, and I'll catch up with you guys next time for our next adventure. Who knows what we'll get into. Until next time, have a great day. Keep living the dream. Peace.